Have you ever looked up at the stars and wondered, are we alone in this vast universe? It's a huge question, and one way scientists try to answer it is by looking for signs of other advanced civilizations. The framework they often use is called the Kardashev scale, which ranks civilizations based on how much energy they can harness. Right now, humanity isn't even on the scale yet. We are what you might call a type zero civilization. We are still mostly reliant on the fossil fuels stored within our planet. To become a type 1 civilization, we'd need to master all the energy available on Earth. That means harnessing everything from geothermal and wind to the full power of the sunlight hitting our planet. It's a massive leap in technology and energy management. Scientists, like the physicist Michio Kaku, Estimate we might reach this incredible milestone around the year 2271. Imagine a world where energy shortages are a thing of the past. But what would that even look like? Think planetary scale weather control, cities that span continents, and a truly global, interconnected society. A type 1 civilization would have complete command over its home planet. But the journey there is a bit tricky. We face some major hurdles, what scientists call existential risks. Things like climate change, asteroid impacts, or even runaway artificial intelligence could stop our progress dead in its tracks. It's a race against time, really. We need to solve these massive problems before we can even dream of leveling up. So, how do we get there? It's not just about building better solar panels. It requires a massive team effort from all fields, scientists, engineers, sociologists, and policymakers. We need to work together to understand the complex path of a developing civilization. The Kadashev scale isn't just a sci-fi concept. It's a roadmap and a warning. It shows us the incredible potential we have, but also highlights the dangers we must overcome to secure our future among the stars. The search for alien life really starts with us by ensuring our own civilization survives and thrives. What do you think is our biggest challenge to becoming a type 1 civilization? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more cosmic explorations.